You know when you hear about a place that seems to take on some sort of mystical quality? I'm finally going to a restaurant that I've been hearing about for years. It's the combined work of 50 families, all migrants to WA, who want to give back to their new community. I hope you're hungry. The restaurant is located on a prime piece of real estate on the Perth foreshore. It's been here since 1991. So, whatever it's doing, it's doing well. It may not look like much from the outside, but stepping into the kitchen, the aromas, the energy, just blow your mind. They are using thousands of years old recipes in here to create something you just won't get anywhere else in the country. Let's find a chef that's not too busy. <laughs> so, Suresh, this is a big pot. You don't do small portions. No. How many kilos of rice is there? This is right. This is about uh, 30 kilos of rice today. And you must use a lot of West Australian produce. Yes, we use green, a lot of green chilli for this because of spiciness. Yep. And we use a uh, cumin seed yep. and we use a. Uh, especially uh, oil that we use in Australia. And all these pots, I've seen some beautiful vegetables going yes. in them. Cauliflower and, and potatoes. Yes. Um, everything you do on a daily basis, nice and fresh. Yes, of course, we do it freshly every day. And the, the flame that you use to do these big pots? Yes. Is gas? Of course. Mm. It's, a, it's a beautiful gas and this rice will be ready within 15 minutes. And if I wanted to learn how to cook here, can I come and learn? Yeah, of course. Uh. We have a cooking class going on here yeah. on every Tuesday in a traditional way that we are cooking and there's uh, two chefs here to teach them. Inside the dining room door, the decor is simple, more like a dining hall, but with a million dollar view. Up the front, the buffet, where Shiresh's team's food takes centre stage. It's more than just feeding people's hunger. There's a unique philosophy behind the food, which starts with its name. The name, Anna Lakshmi, Anna means food. Lakshmi is the divine mother the goddess of sustenance. So Anna Lakshmi is the mother of sustenance. And there's a whole concept behind the food, isn't there? What's the... The, whole... the philosophy behind Anna Lakshmi is Atiti Devo Bhava, ancient Sanskrit adage, means guest is God. So here, everybody is treated the same. All we want to do is feed people with all the love unconditionally. When I was downstairs in the kitchen, everybody seemed so happy, even though they were working so hard. I've heard a little rumour that you've got volunteers on staff. Yeah, Analakshmi only runs on majority by volunteers. So the food is cooked every day by all the mothers and grandmas. They all are volunteers. All they want to do is unconditional giving. So they love cooking. They, that's what the mother knows, so they, to feed all the children. Right, enough talking about this food. Let's tuck in. The food here is divine. I can imagine an Indian mother cooking this up for her family with so much love. And interestingly enough, there's no pricing on the menu. They want you to pay what the food's worth or what you feel it's worth. And the best part about that, it's food for thought and food for the soul. 